Hey, this is going to be just a quick short video today. Uh, I've been getting a lot of questions on how I routed my uh, gauges for the wideband, for example, the power to it. And if you saw our last video, we just did the manual, the electronic boost controller, and we did the power source to A25 on the ECU, just tap into it. Um, for things like gauges, what I like to use is right in the fuse box. It's an ignition powered 12 volt. So let me, just, let me show you. As you can see right there, ignition is off, no power, turn ignition on, and it gives power to the gauges. That way, it's always on when the car's on, and it's always off when the car's off. I have this running to, and I'm, I'm not an electrical genius whatsoever, so if this is wrong, please let me know and I'll try to correct it. But I have a 10 amp inline fuse. I got this at uh, Pet Boys. And that's hooked up to the positive on the gauges. Then I have it to the fuse box. If you see these little, these male blades, I have a female connector on the one all the way to the right. And if I'm not mistaken, this one right here, the first one on the left, is a constant 12 volt. And the one all the way to the right is a ignition 12 volt right up there. So if you have any questions on uh, how I did the, the gauges for this, if you want to know more in depth, just let me know. Just wanted to show you real quick exactly how I have mine done. All right, guys, take it easy.